Uh, okay. Stay up. Okay. Good morning, everyone. Um, yeah, good morning. This is me when I wake up. Um, I do still have my retainers in, so, yeah. But anyways, um, I'm excited for today. I, um, actually last night, I ended up drafting some emails, uh, to send out to brands. I sent, like, three, um, like, beginning emails, if that makes sense. Like, I created the email then I sent like three follow-up emails and I'm just excited I'm excited to see or hear back from these brands in hopes of working and partnering together um all of which I love their products obviously and I have obviously used their products on my Instagram before or just like generally I use their products so that would be an absolute great start to the year um so yeah you know everyone say a prayer for me okay um no but seriously uh say a prayer for me I I'm not gonna give like a long speech and say like oh like I work so hard but what I do know is that I've always wanted to do this. And it is a great feeling to know that I'm doing what I've always wanted to do. And honestly, I enjoy doing it. Um, I do enjoy doing it, although it sometimes it can seem, you know, like you're not getting anywhere. I am still thankful. I'm still grateful um, because I have come a very long way. Um, even if you have seen, like, my first video posting on YouTube to now. Um, yeah. And, uh, even with, like, modeling, that's something I'm going to be focusing more on this year. I actually have a meeting with a agency today. It's through Zoom, but I'm still excited for that. Um, and this year I'm going to be gathering up some shoots. Um, I have two photographers that I know I want to work with and yeah, so I'm really hoping that I'm able to work with those two photographers this year at the very least. And yeah, so, um, yeah, I said all that to say. I'm very grateful that I'm able to do what I've always wanted and the road to doing what I've always wanted has not been easy at all, child. <laughs> and, you know, one thing I do know is that I feel like because I am myself so well and I know who I am. I make being myself look easy. So to some people, to a lot of people, you know, they don't realize how intense just being who I am is. You know, they don't realize how, what kind of weight I'm carrying just being who I am. Um, but, you know, I've always been myself, which is why I, I know who I am. I've gotten the time to, you know, just understand myself. And once again, that is, or not once again, but that is a lifelong journey. You know, you're continually just figuring out who you are as a person and whatnot. So, yeah, um... I'm just thankful that I do know myself because there are a lot of people that don't. And you can usually tell when people don't know who they are. Um, but I know who I am and I know what I want. So I'm going to get it. Um, but yeah, I'm going to get ready to 
what am I going to get ready to do? I'm going to get ready for this meeting. Even though, oh my god. Even though it's not until 5 o'clock, I still want to get ready for it. I may need to go pick up my prescription. Um, I also ordered some HelloFresh. Sir, I'm excited for that. Um, I'm going to try to order HelloFresh every two weeks. Um, yeah, I like HelloFresh. When I lived in San Antonio, um, I had tried them out. And I really liked it, and literally all the meals are good, so. Yeah, but today I'm kind of just going to bring y'all along with me. Um, whatever I do, if I don't do anything, y'all will know. So, yeah, I'll see y'all after I get ready. Getting ready for a meeting, guys. Uh, give me one second my meeting I was gonna ask you to look cute for my meeting oh, that's what I forgot to get um ow fuck oh my goodness yeah I can't find my fucking other hoop so annoying I'm gonna throw on some blush. I also have to put on some moisturizer just to, you know, not look so crazy. Um, I wonder if I put this ugly hoop on, will I look as crazy? Let's see. Can you tell these are different? You kind of can. I'm annoyed. Uh. Damn, I just needed to get it in the hole. Uh. This really has fucking annoyed me. exactly why I fucking hate these earrings. Literally, Target, fuck you. What the fuck is this? Like, these are the shittiest fucking earrings I've ever, ever used. Like, what the fuck? <sighs> Hello. Can I continue with Yes, this is Shakori. Ooh. Okay. So, um, Fresh sent me this moisturizer. 
Lotus Youth Preserve. Oh my goodness, I'm trying to get comfortable. Um, can you see that? Yeah, it's pretty good. Um, I really don't have many thoughts about it. So far, so good, I guess. But anyways, as you can see, I'm stressed. Not really. Um, earlier, I told y'all that I had drafted some emails to send out to brands and we're off to a very good start. Let me just say that, you know, I, um, I have a habit of like wanting to share everything with the people that I care about and I have to get, I have to gain a new habit and start, um, just preserving things just so you know, the people who are going to be happy for me can be happy for me in the moment without knowing prior. Um, I think it's just how I want to go about things now, I guess. Um, but yeah, I should also get some SPF. Well, I'm not really going outside, but I did have my laser appointment. I don't know. I'll just get a little bit. I'll be back. But, um, so yeah, I... Just have to get into the habit of preserving things <sighs> because i don't know that's just how i want to be i love sharing things too but you know like i said you heard me anyways um but yeah today's been stressful kind of because i thought i was gonna go pick up my prescription um which i've called like two three times now and still hasn't been refilled mind you i'm out of it so i called the fucking clinic and i'm like what's going on child and they're like well you can't uh they can't refill the refill the prescription until you rebook your appointment so i'm like okay and i mean that's why i called them because i was like the pharmacy had told me that too so i was like okay let me just call the clinic get this cleared up get a fucking an another appointment so i can get this shit because the medication like you have to stay on it in order for it to fucking work child um anyway so i call the clinic and they tell me like they can't refill my prescription until or like the person at the front desk tells me that they can't refill the prescription so i have another appointment and i'm like okay well that's why i called so can you help me and they're like well we don't have any appointments available for like two to three weeks So I can't get a refill, but you have to stay on this medication in order for it to work. And like, what? <laughs> How does this work? Anyways, um, you can also like leave a voice message when you call them. So the first time that's what I did, I left a voice message and thankfully whoever got the voice message, they reached back out to me and they were like, we're gonna get you an appointment, yada, yada. Anyway, so I got that covered. Um, also I have, a meeting i feel like i already told y'all that i have a meeting that's what i'm getting ready for now um so i'm super excited about that and uh, <laughs> yeah today's going pretty well actually i'm still waiting for my hello fresh um and yeah that's what i'm waiting for i'm gonna put on some blush uh, where did i put it so we're using the Bionic Blush from Milk in the shade Infinity, I believe. Yeah, in the shade Infinity. Um, I really like this. And it's very subtle. Oh, I'll do it on the back of my hand first, just, you know, just to, ooh. Yeah, she's really. Ooh, oh my God. So I haven't done my makeup in a while. So I'm waiting to do some new tricks, but I've been seeing more and more people put their blush like touching the corner of their eye. And I love that. So let's see how it looks.
I kind of love, I mean, not kind of, I love this blush because it just blends so seamless and it kind of like fades away. Like I love that. Like it doesn't look like I have product on my face. Like, yes, that's what I want. Also, um, while I was in bed, I was like, I saw, um, I mean, me and my friend have been talking about creating vision boards, but I saw, uh, Maya Michelle on Instagram doing it and it reminded me like, bitch, you need to do a vision board too. So that's what I did this morning. I haven't finished it though. So hopefully I finish that soon. one but yeah i'm super excited uh this year is going really good already um i'm just super excited like i know god has a lot of things in store for me and if you're not religious then whoever you believe in i um but i genuinely believe like god just has like so much more in store for me and my future I'm just really thankful, really grateful for everything that I have. And yeah, um, I also wanted to show y'all these sunglasses that I got. Aren't they so cute? Ah! <laughs> they don't look so cute. I love these. They give me very matrix. Uh, I'm gonna show y'all all of them just because why not? Um, I don't really like these as much, like they're super fun this really isn't the vibe right now i got them all from urban outfitters though and i got this as a christmas gift to myself because i was like i want some shades and i don't really wear shades but kind of trying to you know venture into the you know shade game so i love them these give me very like spikely Ah, love it. Um, these are one of my absolute faves. Like, don't these just give you, like, rich bitch? I love it. Sorry. Uh, I love it. Like, yes, Miss Corey. Um... What do these give? Ouch. I feel like these give like school teacher, but like wants to be cool. Oh, and I get my hair done tomorrow. Oh my goodness. It's been a long fucking time. It's been a long time coming, which is why I have this part of my hair, you know, just like, you know. <laughs> because it's a mess, like it really is a mess. But I finally bleached my roots, as you can see, my baby hairs are blonde as fuck. Um, but you know, my hair actually looks so much more um, blonde on camera. It's really like a brown, if you can see. It's, it's like brown, it's like brown. Oh my God, do y'all like my, ah, isn't it cute? I'm trying to create like a little studio setup right there. For what I have coming, honey. So, yeah. Um, but I actually want to put on some perfume. And that makes me feel better. What should I wear? Do, 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 do. I think I'm going to do Burberry Her and Oriental Cherry. Oh, no, that's fine. Yes. These two smell good together, so. Oh. Fuck. This is some dossier. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, this is from dossier. It's supposed to be a dupe for the Tom Ford 
lost cherry um i don't know what the lost cherry smells like but i know that smells beautiful so this is um burberry her uh like ah i love it everything these two together match made okay i love mixing fragrances that's like mm -hmm. it's kind of like my new thing Um, yeah, also, if you don't follow me on Instagram, you should be following me on Instagram. I finally hit 30k. Um, I'm so thankful. I'm so great. Well, I just, oof, honey, I could get emotional. I could get emotional. I could get emotional. I could. I could. I could. Um, oh my goodness. Also, I'm probably going to post this on the anniversary of my transition um i started my transition on the 7th of january last year uh 2020 wait 2021 oh wow we're in 2022 yeah i started my transition uh last year january 20 oh my goodness january 7th 2021 huh. and i'm just so proud of myself for multiple reasons um it's just very, it's beautiful, you know, a lot of people, I just feel like for trans people, getting to the point of even realizing that you are trans is such a blessing, you know, and really living in your truth, um, it is truly a blessing, and like I feel like I was saying earlier, like, a lot of people struggle when they don't know who they are and i'm just so thankful to have such an understanding for myself that i do recognize who i am as a person and yeah like it's it's easier to navigate my life because i know who i am you know what i mean and for some people it isn't and you know god bless them but i'm very thankful for just my self-awareness and my understanding and yeah i'm also super thankful for everyone who has been a part of me just growing as an individual and just supporting me through my growth uh because you know a lot of the time people don't they don't know how to accept change. A lot of people are very comfortable with who they are. And there's nothing wrong with comfortability. But, you know, I'm the kind of bitch that's going to roll with the tide sometimes, honey. Well, when it comes to me, um, you know, I know me best. So, I have to trust myself. And, you know... Do what makes me happy and that's what i've done and that's what i will continue to do so yeah i encourage everyone to be that way um it will definitely allow you to truly feel happy from the inside out and when you're happy you tend to want to make other people happy um now you can't get lost in making everyone else happy but when you're happy, it just radiates. Like happiness will radiate, positivity will radiate, and things will just flow the way they're supposed to flow. So, yeah. Yeah, I'm sorry, I keep looking at emails, but <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah, I'm also gonna show y'all like when I make my food. I um I told y'all I got some Hello Fresh, so I'm super excited. I got these ginger pork noodles, um, which is what I'm gonna make tonight. I also got this sweet chili green bean bowl or something like that. Um, what else did I get? Some pork chops and what else did I get? Oh, I got some chicken, but it's like has like a dill sauce Oof. Ooh. i'm so excited um but yeah what time is it 
Um, so yes, um, yeah. Um, I don't know if y'all knew this, but I have always wanted to model. Growing up, my grandmother had like a shit ton of magazines, a shit ton of magazines. And I was always like looking through them when I came over her house and just looking and observing. And I always just felt a connection to the models. Like, that is one day going to be me. And, you know, I'm finally really chasing that, really stepping into that because it's something that I want to do. It's something that I'm going to do. And, yeah, I'm super excited because I'm just ready to prove to myself that, like, this is something that little Corey has always wanted and we are truly gonna live out live out our dreams you know what I mean and I'm just excited <laughs> I'm excited and I'm ready for just all that my life has in store and yeah yeah um I just have so many things I want to do so many things I want to do but like I'm kind of like starting oh my god I'm kind of like starting at specific things, obviously. Um, a lot of people don't probably know this, but I love to cook. So somewhere in my future, I want something in my, even if it's like a hobby, like I just want to share my cooking experiences with people, I guess. Sorry, the lights, the sun is going down, but yeah i just love i just love a whole bunch of shit i mean i love a whole bunch of shit but i also love very specific things like modeling um cooking beauty obviously um yeah there's just so much i want to do in my life life is so precious so you really have to literally just go after everything that you want because if you don't it's like what's the point you know so i wonder does this blush look good hmm. i'm kind of living for these shades now actually um but yeah yeah i can't stop smelling but it's just because i'm really happy i'm really happy with where i'm going in life and yeah but I'll come back when I start cooking. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna make this long, but I only have one question. Um, how do you expect to get to where you want to be if you're not putting in the work? Oh, <laughs> okay, uh, guys, I am in bed. I also didn't get my HelloFresh package. I know I look crazy, but so this is how I go to sleep, anyways. Um, yeah, I didn't get my HelloFresh package, and I'm really annoyed because I was really counting on that. Um, yeah, so I ended up having to improvise. I will insert a picture of what I made myself tonight. I made some pasta, and before I had my pasta, I had a Caesar salad. Um, also, if you're interested and you want to see me cook, and you are interested in the things that i cook then you should follow me at Corey cooks i just made that <laughs> um instagram account uh i'm just gonna be showing you guys like what i make and the ingredients um right now it's just like for fun so yeah um but other than that yeah i just wanted to close out the video um today was a super great day i cannot wait to share everything that like kind of happened today um yeah just know miss Corey is working just know i will continually go up okay in everything that i do and everything that i put my mind to um so yeah i just want to come back and tell you guys that i love you and 
I probably won't make a video tomorrow, but if I do, you will obviously see it. Um, but yeah, anyways, I love you guys, and make sure you subscribe, make sure you like this video, and I'll see y'all later. Bye!